time I heard about MS Square was from my guidance counselor at school. She introduced the program to, to students like myself. And originally when I heard it, I heard three summers and I was a little thrown off by that. Like, I'm not going to school during the summer, no way. <laughs> you know, I mean, not, you know, what, what for? I don't need to go to school during the summer. No, you gotta apply, you gotta apply. And I finally applied. And I didn't know it was for five weeks. I didn't know I would be able to see my family for the whole time. Like I was, when I got to the interview and she told me all that, I was like, ooh, for real. The process for applying to MS Squared was you had to be interviewed by Ms. Burgos. Um, you had to send transcripts from your counselors and your grades and everything from high school. And then I get an email saying I got accepted and I, I start crying because I, it was just so amazing. Like I'm going to Massachusetts and I never thought that like a girl like me would go somewhere like, like that. On the reservations, it's, it's just usually dirt. And you come over here and it's just nothing but greenery and grass and everywhere you go. And it's just kind of gives you that sense of happiness on just exploring the kind of world, basically, going somewhere you've never been before. Here I finally found people who were like me. Kids who had ambition, had dreams, and were willing to work for it. Who, were, who weren't willing to let go of their culture, weren't willing to let go of their backgrounds. Instead, they used that to push them forward and to um, greater things in life. How did I get there? I started as an MS Square. I was in the same seat that all of you guys were in, you know? And, and the point is, you set your sights high, right? Because you can truly do or be anything you want to be. All the teachers here are really, how do I say this? They're really fun. Like, they think of, like, new ways to express the same topic that I would learn at home. So like they would come at it as a different way, like a different experiment or a different challenge, like a different game. One thing I liked about MS Squared is that it took me out of my comfort zone. I had to communicate, I had to talk, I had to put myself out there. Outside of MS Squared, I met people from um, Turkey, Russia, China, Japan, all over the world. So I also had experiences to, you know, grasp what they were talking about, like their own cultures, traditions, and you know, things of that sort. So MS Squared has this tradition called cultural sharing. One of my favorite things about MS Squared was the cultural sharing. As we perform this show to ex like just express our culture, we could be singing, acting, or poetry, anything, just or dances also, just to express what we have, what we have to offer, and who we are, and share it with other people who might never like experience that back at home. I am so grateful for the college counseling course here. I'm so grateful. And I think getting a, a head start on it here during the summer will help me so much during the school year and make it so much easier for me. This has made this made a huge, huge difference in my life and I would not be where I am today um, but for um, Phillips Andover and MS Square. Well, I'm tending to, in my career, go into the mechanical engineering field and create amazing things, but also with a connection to my, to some civic engagement where I'm able to connect the stuff that I'm doing with engineering to help communities that are in need. At some point you start to realize that that life is not just about yourself and your small community. You realize that the world has a lot of problems. And if we can do things, if we can actually intervene, we can make the world a better place. I love it here. I just, there's not much more to say than that.